Hey groovy people, it's me Zenjen. We're walking to the pond in our neighborhood. We're gonna go <laughs> we're gonna go swimming to relieve some stress. Um, it's about 80 here today. Um, got a bicycle it just went by. Here comes a car. And um, we had some really disturbing thing happen at the school today regarding Brianna, to me it seems like retaliation on the school district's part towards our family once again um, because we attempted to enter negotiations with the school district upon Justin's release from the hospital and they were very adversary to say the least. I will be accounting this in my... <laughs> I have a book that I probably am very stirred to write about now. I'm pretty pissed um, about our story with the public schools. Love letters to the public schools, I'm going to call it. Anyway, um, and letting people know what kind of experiences we've had and what kind of experiences go on all the time in special education uh, bodies. Uh, which seem to be like this little utopia separate from the rest of the school. Like most people who have typically developing children, mainstream children, wouldn't have to deal with this kind of crap. But anyway, a teacher boldface said to Brianna after a whole year of giving accommodations, um, said, oh, I just found out you're not on an IEP, so we can't give you these accommodations to extra time right before her test. And little tender soul that she is got upset before her test, imagine, and uh, came home. You know, three, four hours later, still in tears. They're still very upset and <laughs> cried when she got home. Yeah. And um, very poor handling, no email ahead of time, no counselor contacting us when they should. Just a bunch of crap. I'm so tired of it. Look for me on the news with a big frickin' sign in front of the school district petitioning them. Later. <laughs> Real tired of it. Peace out. We're gonna try and take this anger and make it into produ producing results. Bye bye. <laughs>